This family business that's run by Keith his, and his daughter Betty and his wife Jenny is now expanding to a, a 20,000 square foot facility because of the success that they have had in working with China. That's going to double their staff and it's going to double their business. In 2011, Adnac is going to export over 1 million pounds of live crabs to China. Now, Adnac does a lot of their business with three Chinese cities that we're going to be visiting on this, on this trade mission with Shanghai, Beijing, and Guangzhou. But uh, we are also going to go to India. We are going to go to Delhi, to Mumbai, to Bangalore, Chandigarh, and Amritsar so that we can build our relationships in India as well. The delegation that we will bring with us will be the largest delegation that has ever gone on a trade mission from British Columbia. It will assemble the widest range of sectors ever represented on any provincial trade mission that has ever gone from Canada. And accompanying our delegation will be Ministers Bell, Minister Thompson, and Minister DeYoung. And I know that all of them will join me in doing everything they can to be the best possible salespeople for our province. I am very honored that I'd be able to take part in some events of this trade mission. This trade mission would open doors for Adnac Seafood by giving me an opportunity to build business relations and take our big business to the next level. This is a unique chance in British Columbia's history. A unique moment for us to reach out because we are a safe harbor for investment, because we sit on the edge of the Pacific with a port that's three days closer to China than any other in North America, because historically we are so rich culturally and we have so much to offer in terms of our relationships, our human resources, our intellectual capital, and our wealth of natural resources as well. This is our moment, and it's why I always say when it comes to building the future, Canada starts right here in British Columbia.